See, guys? Look, it's a new shed, said Ricky. Well, nah, it doesn't look too bad, but I don't think I will be sleeping in that. Shit looks cool. Doesn't look too bad. Oh, I like sleeping in the open, said Reginald. Well, not engines like not all engines I mean like to sleep out in the open, said Derek. The skinny controller did say there is room for at least one engine in that thing. Well let me try it out, said David. Then David back up into the shed. The shed was nice, and the shed was small, but David could fit in it. And he tried, but he stopped. Uh, guys, I really don't think I can fit in this thing. Come on, back up a little bit more. Okay. <laughs> hey guys, look, I can fit in this shed. Well, I guess the shed can fit you, said Ricky. Yeah, but I don't really want to be in here, but it feels so nice. And I'll have to sleep out in the open. So, yeah, I guess I'll sleep here. Well, that's fine with me, said Reginald. Okay, Reginald, let me move all your way so I can, so you can get back to your job, Diamond. Yep, from now on, I'm sleeping out in the open. I guess I'll go, said Derek. Yeah, <sighs> I'm getting a little tired, said Ricky. And they both left the yards. <sighs> Finally, some peace and quiet. Next morning, David felt better. <sighs> I might have to sleep here for the rest of my life. <sighs> Feels so good sleeping in there. But I gotta do my jobs. Well, I'm off to collect my coaches. Later that day, David collected his coaches and set off. Reginald, a good train is on the way and you will have to back up, said, said his driver. Well, okay, said Reginald as he backed up. But he backed up too far and fell off the track. Oh man, not again. Uh, hey David? Yeah? Reginald has derailed and I'm too busy to uh, save him, so can you please uh, save him for me? But my coaches! For, you, you can come back to get your coaches. Just please help him. Okay, said David. Then David left his coaches and set off to help Reginald. When David saw Reginald, David was shocked. Whoa, what the heck happened? I had to back up because a good train was coming. But... Uh, now I derailed, and I'm in the path of a goods train. The goods train is gonna go on this set of track. You gotta help me, David. Okay. Then David chuffed up to Reginald. And he pulled him out just in time. Thanks, David, said Reginald. No problemo, said David. But I gotta get back to work. So, goodbye. 
Okay, I guess I should get back to work too. Then, after a hard day of work, David went back to the shed to rest. Hmm, I like the shed. But maybe it should be a, be a bit larger and spaced out. Yeah, that would be good. A larger, more spaced out shed to give me some more room. Then David fell asleep.